Hey YouTube, how are we all doing? Corvus here with the first update after my summer holiday basically. Uh, so yeah, it's over once again. Uh, summer is coming to an end. Here in Belgium we have a bit of a cold weather now this, this week. Uh, rainy. I think it's, just not, it's a bit too early for autumn already. But uh, yeah, you can start feeling that the season is, uh, is coming to an end. The summer is coming to an end. Uh, holiday has been great. Um, been to, to Italy for uh, 10 days first, beginning of August. Uh, very hot, but very, very nice. Um, after a while I got used to, to the temperatures and it was okay. And in the holiday park where we were, uh, there was a big swimming pool there. So that was okay when the, 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 at the, the hottest uh, moment of the day. Uh, then we went to the swimming pool and we just, uh, yeah, we soaked in the swimming pool to cool down. Uh, it was very nice there. I mean, every day we had uh, past 30 degrees. Um, or even days with 36, 37 degrees there. Very nice weather, no rain or whatever. Uh, then we went home back. We back back home for a couple of days to do uh, the necessary washing and ironing. And then we went to, uh, to the Dutch seaside, uh, like we do every year for uh, another, I think it was a week and a half. Uh, my parents-in-law have a holiday home there, so it's, it's always nice to be there on holiday. Um, yeah, the kids have everything they need there, so uh, very relaxing. Uh, so, a lot of time to to, to work on the miniatures. Um, uh, I took took the Age of Sigmar uh, box set uh, with me uh, in Italy, uh, a couple of sprues, so I assembled most of the Sigmarites there. Uh, underestimated the work uh, a bit. Um, by the way, there, the last video I did on the channel before this one, uh, I did uh, the days in between we, between holidays. So when we got back from Italy, I showed you the progress on the Sigma rides. So basically, all the the good guys are finished. Um, I think two two of the chaos characters have also been been assembled. And then uh, for the last two weeks, I started. Uh, Painting up the Sigma rides, so I have them here. I'll do, we'll do a video, usual uh, video in more detail uh, soon when I when painting has has progressed a bit, so that will be well visible. I know with the phone I'm using, um, but it gives an idea about uh, about the color scheme. So uh, there was a video in which I explained the color scheme a bit. I have it here. Uh, try, I'll try to, to make a bit of a scheme uh, to try out some colors. So, uh, this was the main color I already decided. It's, yeah, it's called Dectem by Valego model color. I already decided on this one, and then I had these two secondary colors, but uh, was a bit in doubt about uh, which which color to use for the as a main color for the shields and the shoulder pads, etc., and which one for as a secondary color for uh, like the pieces of cloth here, for example. Um, but in the end, so I did some some testing here on the on the bases. So when I finished uh, the armor, I did, uh, did some tests here on the bases, and then eventually decided uh, decided on the blue. Still have to start working on the blue. It's just base coated here, not shaded or anything. But I think it's, uh, it's it was a good decision. So uh, making quite good progress on these guys. Um, in other news, I started working on a commission. Uh, earlier this week, so um, it's Belial figure for Warhammer 40k. A uh, bit of a shame that it's it's fine cast, but uh, yeah, I think we have to do it uh, uh, with with uh, with the quality we have here. Already tried to smooth out some areas here with the uh, with milliput and, and yeah, try to fix some stuff here and there, but of course you can't can do wonders and can start re-sculpting entire stuff. So I made this, also made this clear to the to the customer, um, and uh, yeah, of course he agreed with me. Uh, he also knows about fine cast because he's a painter himself, uh, but he just want he likes to paint uh, rank and five miniatures. Doesn't like to uh, put a lot of time in uh, in characters. So that's when guys like me come into uh, into play, the commission painters. So. Nice uh, job in between. Another commission is probably coming up. Uh, we'll do some uh, vampire vampire counts, probably two characters and maybe some troops. But uh, still working on uh, on the details there. 
so that might also be uh, coming up so that will mean that my Sigmar project will be postponed a bit but uh, no, it's just nice to have this uh, switch between projects and have a bit of uh, I mean I'm working on a Sigmar on and off now for a month so it's okay to to, uh, to work on something else um, other thing you might have seen this one and also if you uh, check the logo of my channel here you notice that this new logo I'm working on a new website as well uh, and on the logo for quite a while because it's pretty silly that yeah I spent quite a while working on the logo I, I already quite early decided on the on the the Raven uh, silhouette um, but then the letters yeah I tried out a few fonts few few uh, different um, layouts for the letters and then let it rest for a week and take a look again and uh, just play around with some colors but eventually went for a quite a simple logo and this is just printed black and white just to test it out but basically it's going to be gray with black maybe uh, on a probably on a gray as you see it on my channel logo on a gray background just the um, the bird in black and then basically the the letters uh, being cut out and that will also be kind of a stamp watermark I will use on uh, on the miniatures uh, pictures of miniatures etc and then maybe on a website I will work with a black background have the bird in dark gray and then maybe the letters in a bit, uh, a bit lighter gray but we'll see how that goes pretty happy about it eventually um, other stuff I noticed last month yeah of course GW are doing a great job with the uh, with the new releases on uh, Age of Sigmar, I mean those those gigantic uh, scenery is pretty amazing to see, and also the the new models that they that they put out are quite amazing. They really uh, they saved up so much work for the painters, I guess, uh, and the sculptors, and, and I think they did a great job in keeping keeping everyone quiet, uh, keeping the rumors down because. Yeah, there's so much new stuff coming out and uh, doing a pretty pretty good job. Another thing, uh, another piece of news I noticed is Weird is going uh, to... Yeah, they're starting with a new game which will be compatible with uh, with Malifaux, I guess, but they only released a, a teaser. Um, was it on Gen Con? Not sure yet. It was some kind of games fair in, uh, in the US uh, that they released a teaser. So also looking forward to that. Uh, just wanted to before I started working on this video. I started this video. I just had lots of stuff in mind, and I I feel like I'm forgetting most of it. Um, oh yeah. Also, I've, uh, before we went on holiday, we we bought a new camera. So just a pocket camera, something a compact camera, just like like the previous one. But what's what's nice and what's probably going to be very useful is that this has this this screen you can fold open and you can turn around. So that will be will be a lot easier to uh, to to use when uh, recording videos of me painting um, because yeah last time when I when I was doing a tutorial yeah, I really had to sit in an awkward position and then look at the screen uh, I really hurt my back then uh, so uh, I hope it will be be a bit easier already noticed one one little problem is that it doesn't seem to auto focus while I'm filming but that could be could be a setting as well uh, just have to to test it out a bit more um, I guess that's it. That's all I want to say for this vlog video. We're approaching uh, nine minutes now, so as usual, I will try to keep it down to uh, at least a uh, maximum of ten minutes, so around ten minutes. So it's uh, now. I think it's a good time to uh, to wrap things up. Um, there will be another update video on the Sigma rides probably, and then I will. Uh, Tonight I will even start painting on uh, painting Belial already, so I'll also keep you up to date on that. Um, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.